Hey guys. So I'm actually not drinking coffee today because I don't want coffee. I've been getting addicted to these sparkling ice drinks, so I'm drinking one of those. But just to keep it titled, because I know y'all watch out for, you know, coffee time um, or coffee. Yeah, coffee time, right? So I wanted to tell y'all, okay, I have been, I don't even know where to start with this. This is something that just kind of like off the cuff. I've been praying since we got back from Maine, where I got my hoodie, um, that another trip would come along. I love, love traveling. However, my husband doesn't have any vacation time pretty much whatsoever left. So I was like, you know what, if I pray for it, God will answer eventually. And whether that be like a weekend road trip or whatever, you know, like I'm not that hard to please when it comes to traveling. Um, so anyways, so we get in the car last night on the way to the award ceremony. Hey Brandy, hey. I hate that I don't know y'all's actual name. So when you're hopping on, let me know your name and I'll actually say hi to you as a person and not as an Instagram handle. <laughs> um, but anyway, so we're on the way to the award ceremony last night. And my husband goes, so what do you think about spending next week in Missouri? And I'm thinking like, how? You don't have vacation time and we don't know anyone in Missouri. Um, so then he explains to me his job is sending him to Missouri for a week and because of the nature of the work that I do, because I work from my phone so I can literally work from anywhere, they said that Glory and I are welcome to come along. They've already paid for the rental, the hotel room, all that stuff, so they're not out any money by us going. So I just thought that was really cool because initially I wasn't even thinking, like I've been praying that God would, you know, send another trip our way. But then I was like, it's funny because if I wasn't looking for it, I could very easily, oh, just another work trip. But because I'm looking for it, now, just to give you a little background, I can turn anything into fun. Like, I don't care, this is like a six hour road trip. I don't care if it's a six hour road trip to pick, you know, a freaking dog up that you bought, have lunch and come back. Like, that's fun to me. I'm Again, I'm not super high maintenance when it comes to trips. So, a couple hidden blessings with this is it doesn't take any of his, um, PTO days or anything because it's a work trip. So he's paid for it without taking time off. The trip itself is also free. The company is paying for the hotel room and the rental car and everything because when they send them on a work trip, that's what they do. The only thing that we're paying for is going to be Mining Glory's meals. And it's really only lunch because they, they're staying in a pretty nice restaurant that, or pretty nice hotel that the cost of the room also includes breakfast and dinner they have like a I don't know it's like I looked it up last night it looks really good and then so I'm literally gonna be chilling at the pool all next week which I'm pretty excited about already made sure the pool is open too um and yeah so I'm pretty excited so just train yourself to look for the answers when you're asking God for stuff because a lot of times he answers yes but he answers in a way that we're not looking for like this wasn't a you know we didn't plan the trip it was spur of the moment and it was disguised as something else. Yet, I already looked. There's like a mall right across the street. There's a couple fun things that Glory and I can do within walking distance of the hotel. And we're taking it as a week-long vacation. Now, obviously, my husband's going to be working. This isn't necessarily like a fun family trip. But that's okay. Like, again, I asked God to let me travel and to let me travel with Glory. Because really, Brett's schedule is not very flexible right now. Ours are. So this was just an added blessing because we get to travel with him. We get to have like the road, the road trip experience with my husband, but now necessarily he won't be with us the entire time because he'll be working and that kind of stuff. But anyways, now I'm rambling. So whatever, I'm done. But just train yourself to see the answers because if you only are happy with him giving you an answer that looks the way you want it to look, you're never going to be happy with your life. But if you're constantly looking for those answers in unexpected packages, then you're going to realize God is answering a lot more of your prayers than what you even realize. So just be grateful for however he answers it. And I'm excited. So if you're following me, follow along because we're going to spend a week of living and working and schooling out of a hotel room. And it should be interesting and fun at the same time. So follow along. We'll give you, you know, 
day by day like I do and you can kind of see how it works for us. Bye guys.